Welcome back. Well, the cold and bitter air combined with all the gusty winds of wintertime can wreak havoc on your skin and your hair. And joining us on the Rojo to help us rejuvenate from the cold, dry winter, which, by the way, we're only, what, three weeks into it. Kristen Blackbeard is here, manager of Lush at Providence Place. Now, she's going to show us how to make a face mask to keep us exfoliated and moisturized. But wait till you see some of the ingredients she brought in. They're like anything that you would have right Absolutely. in your kitchen. Yeah, fresh ingredients, just as eating fresh fruits and vegetables is great for your health. Uh -huh. It's also great for your skin because you're getting all those natural vitamins and enzymes. Yeah. So you can actually find some great skin care right in your own kitchen. I love it because, you know, sometimes you go out and you're like spending all this money and you wonder if it's going to work. But you have, I mean, it's like fruit and nuts Absolutely. and everything. What do you have for yeah. the ingredients here? So we're using some really amazing fresh fruits and veg. Okay. Um, bananas are full of a ton of potassium, which yeah. is great to help you really absorb a lot of moisture in your skin. Great. So we're going to get started okay. adding a couple bananas. So we need two bananas to the bowl here. Right. And you always Feel want to that. work with nice ripe bananas so they're pretty soft. Okay. Makes it easier to mash and then your skin can really absorb those nutrients. All right, so two bananas. And so you were saying this is helpful for the potassium. But what about, I mean, you have one of those peaches right here? They are, yeah. Fruit juice is a great natural exfoliator. Mm -hmm. And it also helps to um, cleanse the skin without stripping it of its natural sebum. So we love lots of fruits and vegetables. Again, like uh, papayas, mm. peaches. Mm -hmm. They're great for young skin and sensitive skin as a natural way to cleanse. So do we start mashing or do you want Absolutely, everything in first? Absolutely, yeah. Okay. Just go ahead and mash. This is so fun. I love it. It's a great like it snow day out, activity, too. Huh? too. Yeah, Absolutely. Right. Yeah, we're actually going to add some honey right now, okay. which is a terrific natural preservative, which means if you keep this refrigerated, you can actually use this mask for up to about two weeks. Oh, wow, that's great. And you can really use it repeatedly, and it's not going to cause Absolutely, any... Absolutely, yeah. yeah. All these ingredients are nice and gentle. Uh, honey is actually a natural antibacterial, mm -hmm. so it can help with spots and breakouts. Ah. But again, really gentle. It eases redness and inflammation. So. Now, I know you brought some oatmeal and things too, which Absolutely. is, you know, you typically see that in a lot of skincare. You bet. Uh, oatmeal is full of vitamin E, mm -hmm. which is something you hear a lot about in the beauty industry. It helps yeah. keep your skin young and elastic. So we love using oatmeal in a lot of our products. It's also great for eczema, mm -hmm. which can really flare up in the winter oh, time. Yeah. And then we also have some ground almond. You can see, once you grind up the almond, all mm -hmm. that almond oil is released. So this oh, okay. is actually going to really hydrate the skin and add that great exfoliation. So we used about two big tablespoons of ground almond. All right, so again, to recap, honey, banana, peaches, almond, and yes. what is our final ingredient? Oatmeal. And the oatmeal. And we just okay. ground that fine. Mm -hmm. We just used rolled oats we got at the supermarket. Okay, did you grind that up and like, can we you do it like in a queen yeah. or something? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. We used a food processor, but we also have a um, coffee grinder that we set aside for ah, our spices. So once it's all mixed together, do you literally just take some and just slather it right on? Absolutely. Yeah. You always want to put it on nice, clean skin so the mask can really get into your pores and okay. do its job and deliver those vitamins. Yeah. Leave it on for about 10 to 15 minutes, then mm -hmm. rinse it off, apply your moisturizer. You've got wonderful glowing skin looks like you just took a two-week vacation Love it. even when it's 25 degrees outside. and it's like a lot less money than some of the stuff you buy at a counter Absolutely. but if people do not want to make the homemade variety you can head to lush for some of these fresh Absolutely. fresh masks that you have there in the store and we also have a recipe for this online right now for a hair mask as well to keep your hair looking luxurious in the winter time as well thank you so much Absolutely. Kristen thank for coming you. in we appreciate it and by the way we are giving away uh, a product as well on Facebook today so make sure you check that out later as well